Hey guys, I'm in the mood to play a little more Jeopardy, so today we're going to play Super Talking Jeopardy for the original Nintendo, and uh, if I recall, this game is pretty ridiculous as far as uh, some of the animations and graphics goes. Uh, it has some talking effects and some clapping effects, and when those kick in, it blocks out all of their audio, including the background music, so it's pretty insane. I'm just going to turn the volume up a little bit here so I can hear it. Hopefully that doesn't screw up too much with uh, the microphone. But uh, yeah, uh, should be a good one. So let's go. Play which round? Uh, or final round? One player. Nope. Use controls to enter your name. Well, as always, our name is going to be Poop. You will use the button A or B on controller number one to buzz in during the game. Buzz in now to continue. I don't want to... Oh, wow. These... Yeah. Pretty much only white people. That's weird. I guess that kind of looks like me. What do you guys think? Yeah? No? Maybe? Who's this guy? Looks like a good old poop to me. Sorry if there's any, like, um, doubling up or any of the imagery or anything like that. It's, uh, just far the adapter goes. That's definitely Alex Trebek. 50s TV. Nope. Notorious. Don't know. I always in byways, authors, firsts, nursery rhymes. Well, there you go. If you don't want, yeah, I don't want those. War, what? Law, number, please. Why word? Poetic quotes. Sure, this is fine. It's as bad as the first round, but whatever. We will do this. That, oh my god, that, the sound effects. <laughs> uh, Napoleon supposedly said this, an army marches on this. I believe the answer is their stomachs. Uh, they are. Is stomachs? There you go. You were right. <laughs> Dirty Hitler mustache poop. Good job. At Pearl Harbor, Howell 4G said, Praise the Lord and do this. I have no idea. Pass the ammunition. All right. Seems like something he'd say. You furnish the pictures and I'll furnish the war, said this jingoistic newspaper publisher in... <laughs> I don't even know what jingoistic means. Oh, William Randolph Hearst. That, that was my first. My first guest. Guess. Before he was wounded at this battle, Lord Nelson said England expects every man will do his duty. I was going to say Waterloo. I don't. I have no idea. Waterloo. Sure. I don't know who Lord Nelson is. Lord Nelson. Battle. I'm going to say... I'm going to change that. I'm going to say Battle of the Bulge. Uh, T T L E Mod. Um, Jeez. The... Probably not right. Nope. Ticonderoga. I have no idea. Trafalgar. Sure. I shall never surrender or retreat, said this commander of the Alamo. I have. 
have no idea. Santa Anna. No, he's the one that defeated the Alamo. William Barrett Travis. Sure. The 17th century institutes of the laws of England state a man's house is... I know. No. It's be something obvious. His castle. Yeah. That's, uh... That does make sense. As a result of this 1966 Supreme Court case, police now inform suspects of their rights upon arrest. Roe versus Wade? Miranda case. Sure. I don't know. I know. I very much know it's not Roe versus Wade. Um, where the valve... Where, where the valve and controversy shall exceed twenty dollars, you have a right to this type of trial. What? A speedy? Trial by jury. Oh. Okay. Uh, to prevent a tyrannical government, the founding fathers built a system of checks and balances into this document. Pretty sure it's a Declaration of Independence. Uh, Declar. Uh, oh. Oh, the Constitution. As a non-American, I don't know the answers to a lot of American questions. Rep riparian rights refer to the use of these. Pistols. Rivers. An unlucky Friday or a baker's dozen. What is thirteen? Correct. You did it, poop. You smiley bastard. Number of stars on the American flag raised at Iwo Jima. Say forty-eight. The number of square inches in a square foot. A uh, square foot would be twelve inches by twelve inches, one hundred and forty-four. Total number of trombones and coronets in, I don't know, 66. Three million. Ages, how the hell would I know that? The number of times O.J. Simpson played in the Super Bowl. You can really date the age of this game. I'm gonna say four. I I don't know. None. Well, there you go. His career went in the toilet bowl, though. Wilo ox of Asia, or what gossips do? A wild ox. Sorry, it was hard to read. Like, what the hell's a wilo ox? Out of the hole, 
We did it, guys. You and me. We did it. Congratulations. Oh my goodness, daily double. Uh, yeah, I have a thousand dollars. It gives your loaf a lift. What is your mother? E oops. Oops. How'd I go back? Why would you make B be the... Also a buzzing button. That's stupid. Yeah, smiley face. Uh, country bumpkin. What is your mother? I don't know how to spell this, so we're gonna try our best. What is a yokel? Doing pretty good now, guys. We're definitely out of the hole now. The royal bodyguards of Great Britain or clerical petty officers in the U.S. Navy. Yeoman? I didn't know how to spell it. I didn't know. John Culture may have discovered this national park when chased there by Indians. What is the... This game is so old, it's slightly racist. Oh my goodness, yo. Sem... I hope this is how you spell it. Yellowstone. There you go. That was a good guess at a 50% chance. Poetic quotes. Hooray. In a Robert Burns poem, a body meet a body coming through. This. We're just going to sit here for a lot of this, uh, a lot of this category, guys. Yeah, body coming through rye. That makes plenty of sense. In her poem, First Fig, oh my god, the alarming way Edna St. Vincent Millay's candle burns. What is hot? Well, there you go. The Cardinal Virtue, Emily Dickens, Dickinson calls the thing with Feathers that perches in the soul. Last hope. There you go. Cool. Should be a skip category button. We just say no. You don't answer any of them. Uh, let the Irish vessel lie emptied of its poetry. Auden wrote in memory of him. Who is Chaucer? William Butler Yeats. Keats composed his own epitaph to read, Here lies one whose name was writ in stone. Or water. That doesn't make any sense at all. You're a drunk man, Keats. Arnold Zenker replaced this trusted CBS newsman during a 13-day union strike in 1967. Um, Walter Cronkite? Let's try that. Cron. I don't know the spells like Cronkite. Kite. 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 There you go. Good old Walter, Walter Cronkite. Jean Jean the Dancing Machine was among the talent on this Chuck Barris series. Gong Show, I believe. What was the Gong
Bubbles in the Wine was the appropriate title of this theme song. Of his theme song. Oh, this is going to be difficult, but I think it's Lawrence Welk. A U R E N C P. Oh! That was not space. That was it's Lawrence Welk. Well, I spelled Lawrence wrong, so. I blame it on the, the internet. I don't know. Uh, when Ken Berry took over at the lead, the Andy Griffith show was renamed this Mayberry. I don't know. Don't, never really watched the show. Oh, Mayberry RFD. I don't know what that means really freaking dumb in the spring of 1950 Arthur Godfrey gave TV lessons on playing this instrument what is the hairy banjo the ukulele oh look at that face he just made it's good stuff there Mythology, okay, starts with Z. Ancient Greece, weapons, children's jacks, boxing, sure. Sorry, just got really into the sound effects. The Daily Double in the first. <laughs> sure. Sea nymph with whom Odysseus spent seven years, or the folk music of Trinidad. What? Uh, folk music of Trinidad. Calypso? Calypso? L Y? Clip, 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 so, clip, so. Correct. Irie, Irie, Boomaclot, Trinidad. Boomaclot, sorry. He was willing to die for Damon, who is, um, what's his face? The other guy. Pythias. That's not even a real thing. The mightiest Greek warrior after Achilles, Colgate, now cleans up using his name. Colgate? Crest white strips. Ajax. <sighs> what year was this game made? 1991. 91, everybody. Uh, he and Dale de Dallas escaped from prison by flying. Oh, uh, Perseus? No, that's not right. Icarus. They did it. Norse god of mischief and trickery who is supposed to eventually destroy the world. I think this is right, and if it is right, thank you, TV show Supernatural, for the answer. Z word. Numerically, nothing. That's pretty easy. All these American people watching this, like, you son of a bitch. Z, man. It's freaking Z. Not where I live. Z word. 1000. Bob Dylan before he became Dylan. Who is Bobbert Zemeckis? Bob Zimmerman. There you are. That's your answer. Or 1000. 
from a subordinate clown who mimics the theater sorry the tricks of his leader it means amusingly absurd I have no idea zany okay zany the clown the first name of the 12th president of the u.s Don't know. Zachary. Oh. I guess that is the name that starts with a Z. Considering I know a few of them. Uh, the condition in which the birth rate equals the death rate is known by these initials. I have no idea. ZPG. Cool. Greek word for world, or Sagan's word for universe. You think I know this, because I read a fair amount of Carl Sagan, the cosmos. Jeez. Yes. The Daily Double. Uh, you have to bet it all. It's a rule. Uh, the nine-letter word for the amazing home of the Minotaur. Uh, Labyrinth? How do you spell that? Uh, L A B R Y N Oops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, no, L, Lab, Bar, and, oh my goodness, I already spelled this. Lab bar R Y N T H. Hopefully that's right. Nice. Ooh, look at that face. City state ruled by Pericles. No idea. Athens. Sure. Homer's Tale of the Trojan War. Homer had the Odyssey. Iliad. Homer's Iliad. Jeez. very late. Founder of the Lyceum, his students walked with him as he taught. Uh, Aristotle, I don't know how to spell that. That's how you spell Aristotle. Weapons. Ice pick. Used by Dennis the Menace or David the Slayer. What is a slingshot? Correct. You're right. Good job, mustache. Odd weapon of odd job. I totally read that wrong the first time. What is a hat? A hatchet used by American Indians. What is a tomahawk? Designed to destroy submarines by shockwaves.
charge. I got one of the depth charges. Oh, that works. The extras in operas. I do not know. Spears. Oh, geez. Spare carriers. That was very coincidental. Children's Jacks. A fast food franchise or Child's Papa Playmate. What is Jack in your crack? What is a Jack in the box? Seventeen seventy. We're doing pretty good, guys. The first line of a candlestick jumping rhyme. Do you have to really type in Jack be nimble? Oh my god. What is Jack be nimble? I hope that's one word. One sentence, I mean, there's not a comma after it. Jack be Found a plum in his Christmas pie. Little Jack Horner. Two thousand points. He was on a fat free diet. Jack Spratt, probably. Because I don't know much about Jack Spratt. There you go. There you are. The cat that killed the rat that ate the malt all lived in this house. Jack's, Jack's house. The house that Jack built. There you are. A full count should be this number of seconds in length. 80. Good job, poop. You smiley man. Boxing term for tossing the terry cloth. What is throwing? A TKO is this type of knockout. What is technical? Correct. 
1981, he got 12 million for beating welterweight Thomas Hearns. George Foreman, I have no idea. Sugar Ray Leonard, there you are. In 1965, it took Muhammad Ali less than two minutes to beat him. That was Sonny Liston. I, I don't know. Sonny Liston. There you are. Oh, it's time for a Squishy Face. Let's, Let's do it. Let's play Final Jeopardy. Oh, my God. Carriers U.S. States. Thanks again, Game Tech, for making all of your games only American-based and to screw every other country. All right. My wager is all the money I have, because that's the rule. The number of states that make up the New England states. I don't know. Five. I, I honestly I don't know. There you go. Poop lost it all, because Poop doesn't know that much about New England, or the states that make up New England. The winner code is SXL. Sexy extra large. I don't know what to say, guys. That's a good way to end this. So once again, that was Super Jeopardy for the original Nintendo. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, sorry about the, once again, another anticlimactic end there. Uh, but that's the way it goes when you play Jeopardy, and every time there's a Daily Double, you bet it all. Or fine with Jeopardy, obviously. But yeah, it's a decent game. It's pretty good. Um, not the easiest questions if you're not from the States, but all, you know, Jeopardy and stuff like that are all kind of like that for the NES, Super Nintendo, and N64. Uh, but anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching, and uh, as always, have a good one.